Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. What I'm going to be doing today is straightening up my room. As you can see, my bed is already made because uh, Bay was sick. And with him being sick, I went on ahead and just kind of disinfected and cleaned um, off the bed already. And of course, right now I'm at the console table and I'm removing all of the medication. I also have clothes all around because in the midst of this, I also ended up doing a birthday haul. And my room hasn't really been my room for the past month because I was putting together the design course. And of course, I wanted everything to be clean, to be situated, so that way I could put together a great piece of content. And so today, I'm really just focusing on fully cleaning and organizing and putting things back into their proper place. If I leave tonight, we could do this right We'll find the remedy Or would you stay with me now Till the morning light Before you turn away I just want you to know That I didn't throw your stuff away Before you make up your mind That I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I absolutely love the space that I am in. I have always tried my best to implement everything that I love in my home. And so doing something as simple as lighting my candle halfway through the cleaning process is just so therapeutic for me. As I previously mentioned, I did a birthday haul. This is just a little small snippet of it. While I was cleaning and kind of getting everything situated, I shared some of the items that I purchased, they purchased, and my friend Fash purchased for my birthday. This is just one of the items. If you guys are interested in seeing the entire birthday haul video, it is in the previous upload. And then I'm also going to tether it towards the end of this video. That way you guys can watch it. But after that video, the room was left even more of a hot mess because I had to pull out all of the boxes and unpack the bags and everything because there was clothes and shoes and a whole bunch of other things that didn't make the video. So as I'm cleaning, I'm putting everything up. And let me just say, don't let the boxes fool you. Everything was like pretty like small stuff, but things that I had been looking at. But anyway, the haul is up. You are more than welcome to the channel. So, but just listen, I miss you. And I know that I said all these things But now when you're with her I can see that That you miss me Just stay till the morning light oh. Moving on to the other side of the bedroom Please do not do this at home And I mean this So I like my drapery to be situated perfectly And of course that wasn't happening So I decided to climb up on this chair the chair is a pretty heavy structural chair. Again, do not do this at home, but I just wanted to make sure that the drapery placement was going to be perfect. Um, surprisingly, let me just mention to you guys really quickly, this drapery was the same drapery that was in the previous house, but I had it in the living. And so when I moved here, it didn't work out and I ended up putting it in the bedroom, which I love because before I sold the house, I was actually in process of getting drapery and I was like, oh, let me put the order on hold since I know what my plans were. Second is if you are new to my channel, the previous house, the bedroom was the exact same. Somewhere around here, I'm going to insert like some clips so you can see the previous house. But I love the room. It just makes me feel like I really didn't move because the colors the placement of things are exactly how they were previously. And so, yeah. But anyway, I'm getting rid of bags. I'm cleaning things. I'm moving things around in this space. I 
honestly feel like cleaning in the morning sets the tone for the rest of the day or even cleaning before I go to bed sets the tone. And so doing this so early just kind of set the tone. I had a really great day. I want to point out to you really quickly that one of the things that I did differently in this bedroom is I actually took the mirror and I hung it on the wall. The mirror is from Home Goods. I think it was about like 129 or something like that, but I really love the mirror. A lot of you guys have been asking to see the updated look of the office. It's not done. I pretty much had it situated just enough to put together the design 101 course. Now that I'm done with that, and I say I'm done, but I know in the future I'm going to tweak some stuff with it. I want to go ahead and try to finish it. And once I get done finishing it, I'm going to share it with you. But this is pretty much the view of the office and then panning over into the bedroom so you could see. I really love the fact that I can leave my bedroom and go right into my office with ease. That has been the best thing ever. Also, I want to share with you my bedroom. The reason why the Design 101 course is imperative to your home design is I'm showing you how to understand, maneuver, and fall back in love with your home. I'm sure in hindsight, it may have been said, we ain't going to mention who, that the upgrades that I was doing within the space was a waste. But I do believe in making sure that the space that you are in also gives off the energy that you would like to have. And so looking at the bedroom that I'm currently in right now and seeing how things are very, very much the same, you can also see where things are not the same. The trim in the ceiling, the color, the trim on the wall, the door, the fireplace, it's just not giving that same cozy, vacation-y, luxury space that I would like to exude within the space. Again, I'm still loving the room as is, but you can definitely see how very simple upgrades can give an overall luxe look. They weren't super crazy. They were just on budget for me personally, and I was able to implement those things. Even the scone slice right now being with the console and creating that vignette was just amazing. Panning off to the other side of the bedroom, you can see the hardwood floors, the rug, the shutters, just everything. Again, the bedroom is very much the same, but there are so many things that are just different within the space. I wanted to share that with you because if you were interested in trying to get your home together, then I would highly recommend checking out Design Minutes with SBC 101, which is going to be linked in the bio. So now you get a chance to see the bedroom that I'm currently in again. And so you have a little bit of a comparison between the two rooms and you can see how that trim overall elevated the room. I'm not mad at it whatsoever. The previous house served me well and I know anything that I purchase in the future is going to serve me well again because I'm bringing that same knowledge. I'm bringing that same energy into the space. But like I said, I really love the space overall and what the home is doing. What I am trying to do in the future, and please hold me accountable for this, is I want to do a blog post where it's like a shop my home and I'm able to link certain things. Keep in mind, there are some things in my home that are custom and I just don't have links. It's not that I'm not trying to share with you guys. It's just it's impossible if I'm sourcing fabrics and I'm getting things reupholstered and I'm also doing like secondhand buys and getting work done to those pieces. I don't have a link to share, but the things that I do have links for, I'm going to do my best to sit down one day. Kev, if you're watching, we're going to sit down one day, hold me to it so we can start linking, you know, bed, lamps, decorative accent pieces. Even if it means that you guys are going to order through my vendors, I'm okay with that. But a lot of you guys have been asking for it and I would like to do my best to have it for you. All right, you guys, the last thing left is for me to vacuum, but I'm going to wait and vacuum tonight because, like I said, I'm going to be going out and there's going to be a lot of movement going on. And so my beautiful line is going to be gone. So around 7, 8 o'clock tonight, I'm going to vacuum. So that way, as I'm leaving the house, I get to come back into the room with all the vacuum lines. I left majority of the clothes on the bed right here because I'm going to do a try on haul tomorrow. It's going to be on Instagram and also on YouTube. So I didn't want to hang anything up. I have to take everything back down again. I'll hang that stuff up tomorrow. But for right now, in terms of the room being clean overall, it is 
it is i love it it looks really good super comfortable super everything and so i just wanted to mention something really really quickly and this is pertaining to the design course one of these days i'm gonna sit down not one of these days but really soon so what i talk about in the course hmm is the ratio of your headboard to your pillows and knowing exactly how many pillows to put on your bed when it comes to your headboard and sizing and all of that. I'm happy with my bed. And most importantly, what I really want you guys to take focus on right now is the drapery. They are blackout, so at night, I do have an opportunity to close them. That way I get a really, really nice dark room and then in the morning I can open it and of course get all of my natural sunlight in. But that is pretty much for today's clean with me. I hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you on the next one which will 9 times out of 10 be a try on haul. Have a great day. Bye.